This is the second downtown jobs announcement in a little over a week in this important industry cluster. With Cal and with Don Humby, we've announced the creation of hundreds of new jobs from businesses based abroad. And I'm very pleased uh, to be here today to announce that uh, uh, Cal USA has reached tentative agreements with the state of Ohio and, and the city of Cincinnati to expand our operations in Cincinnati. Included in these tentative agreements are basically three things. Number one, retention and expansion of jobs in Ohio and Cincinnati. Number two, movement of our corporate headquarters and more than 200 employees into downtown Cincinnati. And number three, a significant investment in our current R&D and manufacturing facilities over on Spring Grove Avenue. And are, are hopeful that the proposed agreements will be executed. Um, and you know, you take a look at the list, um, just mentioned um, Don Humby, but when we think about Omnicare, TQL, Intelligrated, uh, uh, Global Scrap Management, Bioformics, where I just was, Tissen Crop over in Butler County, regions starting to come along, Greg. I mean, it's it's really starting to happen here. Ohio is coming out of the doldrums as well. We now, um, as of December, we're, we're up about 45,000 new jobs created. Um, we are number one now in the Midwest in job creation. But the decision to bring the headquarters downtown says a lot of things. It says that downtown is vibrant. It says that downtown is the epicenter. It says that downtown is the hot spot to be. There are services downtown. There is energy downtown. Employees of companies want to be downtown. That's how we attracted Omnicare. That's how we've attracted Dunhumby. People want to be in the vibrant center, the core of the activity in the region. That's what downtown Cincinnati represents.